Here in New York City, a sanctuary city, it's being flooded with migrants. Here's what Mayor Eric Adams had to say about how he's handling this influx of migrants. Watch. Well, Eric, you are giving them more than you're giving every other New Yorker. That's just a lie. We are handcuffed as a city on what federal laws require us to do and state laws require us to do. We're handcuffed. What the real call is, federal government, if you parole people into the city, give them the authorization to work so they can contribute to the city. So we understand that the migrants are sleeping on cots in these shelters, but we're giving prepaid debit cards, and, and he's providing them with $350 a week. Uh, but when you see what's happening there at the southern border, and then now how they're being treated once they get to New York City, does this seem like the right thing to do? Absolutely not. To give these people work permits is only going to further the incentives and the enticement to come here illegally. And John, let me tell you, that's one of the provisions that was in that so-called bipartisan bill Two U.S. senators who were Republicans sided with the Democrats to write this thing. Uh, we passed the H.R. 2 Secure Border Act back in May of last year, almost a year now. It's been sitting on Chuck Schumer's desk. They refused to do anything about it. Instead, they lobby back this failed, flaw-filled bill uh, and want us to vote on it that would, would give people work permits automatically when they come to the United States. That is only going to encourage people. We've got to realize that we have to secure the border. The president has every means within his disposal right now to do that, and he refuses to do that. How frustrated does it make you when Democrats continue to blame the Republicans for the southern border? Very and in the national media, not your, your station, of course, but others, uh, and we see it on social media. I get hit up all the time. Why aren't you compromising uh, with this so-called bipartisan bill? Why aren't you guys doing something to secure any uh, part of our border? Because I will not compromise on a secure border. Yeah. We have the ability to, now to, to end uh, the catch and release program, to reinstate Remain in Mexico, two provisions that would cure about 72% of our problems right now, stop 72 to 75% of the illegal crossings right now. Yeah. But we're not willing to do that. If we can get to a point where we allow up to 5,000 illegals a day into our nation before we start shutting it down, then we have the ability now yeah. to shut it down. And that's what the president needs to do. Yeah, you do the math on that, 5,000 times, 365 days a year, that, that adds up. That's a lot of people coming into the country. Congressman, we have to go. We're out of time. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Thank you.